Has your ex become rude, mean, or cold towards you since the breakup? You know, maybe they used to be extra friendly and kind, but now they're cold, indifferent, or even downright cruel to you. Well, in this video, I'll explain why they've become so mean and what to do about it if you still want them back. Now, if this is your first time on my channel, welcome. I'm Brad Browning, YouTube's number one breakup coach and best-selling author. Now, don't forget to hit like and subscribe. Now, let's get to the topic at hand here, which is why your ex is rude or mean to you. Now, this is actually something that happens quite frequently, so don't think you're alone if this is a scenario you're facing right now. I hear this question from my, my coaching clients all the time. In some cases, it can seem like your ex is, is flip-flopping between being nice to you or even downright you know, affectionate and flirtatious, while the next minute they're being a jerk or ignore, ignoring you altogether. Or you know, maybe your ex just seems to be trying to pick a fight every time you interact with them. Regardless of what your ex is doing, if they are being cold, distant, rude, or confrontational, it's usually for one of three reasons. So reason number one is that they still have feelings for you. As crazy as it might sound, often when your ex is acting rude, cold, or distant, it means that they still care about you or have feelings for you. Their cruelty or, or argumentative behavior is really their way of dealing with these emotions. Usually, this is a subconscious thing rather than an intentional strategy on your ex's part. For whatever reason, your ex has decided that breaking up is the best, most logical way forward. And yet, they're still in love with you to some extent, or at least still have lingering romantic feelings for you and care about you. But these are feelings that they no longer want to have, really, uh, because they simply make getting over the breakup more difficult. And as a result, they can become cold and rude or often try to pick fights whenever you talk to them. It might sound bizarre, but being mean or rude is a common way many people try to suppress these feelings and emotions after a breakup. So if your ex is being very hot and cold towards you, you know, where they're sometimes being nice and affectionate one minute and then suddenly acting mean or indifferent the next, that's a really good indication that they're doing this because they still care for you and have an internal struggle going on within themselves over the breakup. Now, I've actually previously made a video specifically about this kind of um, mixed messaging from your ex, which I'll link to in the description below if you want to watch that. And if you want to learn whether your ex does still indeed have feelings for you, uh, take my free quiz tool at breakupbrad.com quiz. It takes less than five minutes and it'll evaluate where you stand with your ex right now and what your chances are of getting them back. Just go to breakupbrad.com quiz after the video to try it out for yourself. Now, let's move on to the second reason, number two. Uh, they can't stomach the idea of hurting you. So it's possible that your ex is being rude or trying to pick fights with you because they subconsciously feel like this could give them a reason to hurt you by breaking up. Now, this might sound totally insane, but it's actually relatively common. Basically, your ex has decided to break up with you, but because they still have feelings for you and they know you're a good person, they hate the idea of having to hurt you or cause you emotional pain by breaking up. And as a result, they'll sometimes pick fights or be cruel towards you in the hope that you'll take the bait and react angrily or be equally mean and confrontational in response. And this will give them a reason, a sort of justification, that will make hurting you by breaking up more acceptable. Again, I know this sounds like a strange thought process on the surface, but human psychology is often complicated, and things like this can happen subconsciously without your ex even thinking about it. And finally, reason number three, you're just not getting the message. So the third reason your ex could be acting mean, rude, or confrontational is, unfortunately, because they feel this type of behavior is necessary in order to get you to leave them alone and accept the breakup. So by treating you poorly or by being a downright asshole to you, uh, they may be hoping that you'll give them the space that they're looking for and stop trying to win them back. So if you've been pleading or begging your ex since the breakup, asking for another chance, or promising to change if they'll take you back, then your ex could very well be feeling like you're just not accepting the breakup and being cold and rude to you in order to try and break through your denial and get the message across. Now the final question that I want to address in this video is how to react or handle this type of behavior from your ex. You know, what can you do to ensure that they stop being so mean, cold, or angry towards you and go back to being the kind, considerate, and loving partner that you remember from your time together? Well, there's a couple of things that will help in this situation. First, you need to avoid taking the bait and not allow yourself to be drawn into any kind of conflict or arguments with your ex. If they're being mean and rude, then you want to react in a way that they won't expect. By not falling into their trap and by being kind, polite, and maturely diffusing any kind of potential confrontation. Now, it's important not to be too nice to your ex, but you also need to take the moral high road and not let yourself be dragged into any arguments or lash back out at your ex in response to their, their rudeness or their cruelty. And second, in many cases, you may need to re-engage in another period of no contact. Now, typically, there's very little that you can say or do to help change the way your ex is acting, and therefore, ignoring them completely and giving them time and space is often the best strategy to change their behavior and their opinion about the idea of ever getting back together. 
I always advocate shutting down the lines of communication with your ex if you're in doubt about you know what to do, because this is almost never gonna hurt your chances of getting them back in the long run, but it will ensure that you don't fall into their traps or accidentally make matters worse by doing or saying the wrong thing. And lastly, of course, you can subscribe to my channel here on YouTube and take my free quiz at breakupbrad.com slash quiz to find out your chances of ever getting back together with your ex. Thanks for watching, guys. I'm sorry that your ex is being mean or rude to you, and I hope you found the advice in this video helpful. See you next time.